Good morning guys, welcome to Life with Lena and if you guys are new here, please click that red subscribe button down below and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Today is the day that I get my Atipa score report. We've been waiting like three weeks for this now guys, three weeks. Actually, I don't know how I'm gonna wait much longer, like it is 11 o'clock. I have to wait till between 5 and 10 p.m. to get a score report and hopefully I'm on the 5 p.m. side and not the 10 p.m. side because it's gonna kill me the waiting time I've already waited like three so three or so weeks and I can't believe like they just they emailed me yesterday and they were like oh well you're gonna get your score report tomorrow between 5 and 10 p.m. like why couldn't you just tell me my score report already as you guys graded my Atipa I don't understand but Kuba and I are waiting for my school report. Oh, look at that full on stretch. Oh, and his little legs. He kind of were blending in with the carpet though, baby. You were blending in a little too much. But I still love you, I love you so much. So today we have to work on completing those cupcake toppers, adding on those toothpicks onto them. And I also have a lot of video editing to do because I filmed two bullet journal videos yesterday. I just edited one, but I still have another one to edit. And then I have a couple of baking videos that I never even edited and posted and I filmed way back when. And then later today, when my employee goes home at like three or so o'clock, I want to film like a heat embossing video as well. Like I just want to pump out these videos, get them edited to get back on track onto my YouTube game on my main channel because I've seriously been slacking so, so so much all right guys so far I edited two videos the two that I filmed yesterday but I just got some packages in the mail so I wanted to open these for you guys so you guys can see one of these is also from China because I ordered a whole bunch of stuff from Aliexpress for like super cheap with dyes oh this is an embossing folder it's just like a whole bunch of hearts so this is the only thing that I got from China today I also got something from Amazon what did I order I don't remember oh yeah yeah okay so my car charger broke for my phone it doesn't no longer it, it no longer charges phones unless it's like placed in like a specific way but I needed a new car charger so I got this one and I like it because let me show you guys I will have everything linked down below like everything I bought but I like this because this part goes into the charger and one of these pieces is already attached to it so you, I could charge my phone and then it has a USB thing so that somebody else if there's somebody sitting in the passenger seat could also charge their phone by just plugging in a USB and I always have a spare USB in my car as well so it's not like they have to have their own or anything I always have a spare but I do like that one of them is attached so it's not gonna like fall out or anything just in case while I'm driving and I need my phone charging. And then the last thing I got is from Simon Says Stamp. So this was on pre-order when I ordered it. And it's square dies with like these cute little stitched and scalloped and I don't know. It's it's like scalloped and stitched. It's super, super cute. I've been waiting for this to come in. It was on pre-order when I ordered it. So they shipped the rest of my order out first because this was delayed. I think I actually wanna use this today when I'm doing some card making. That's gonna be so fun. all the cupcake toppers now I'm just working on these things that go on top you know they look like this and they fold over so I'm working on those because now I ran out of those so I'm printing and cutting those for the cupcake toppers for when I have to make more and um, we are patiently trying to wait for my Antipa score results um, two hours until I possibly get my results but anywhere from in two hours from now 
till like 10. So in two hours it's five o'clock. So five to 10, oh my God, so stressful. Why can't they just send me their results already? Just finished making so many of these little cupcake um, topper top things, I guess, for the packaging. I made 30 of them. So we got a nice stack of these now. Probably won't have to make these for a while, hopefully, but you know, it's nice to have them when I am making cupcake toppers and then I just combine them with a paper clip so they're not like flying around all over the place. But now it's time to film a video. We have a couple of hours before the waiting time actually begins because I don't know, I'm, you know, it's, the guys, this is just so stressful. Like I just want my score already, but we're trying to kill time as much as possible. So I'm gonna film a video right now for my main channel. It's gonna be like a heat embossing kind of thing. So if you guys don't know how to heat emboss and you guys wanna learn how and you guys need to learn what you need to heat emboss, definitely check out that video. I don't know when it'll be posted, but I am filming that right now. <laughs> All right guys, I just finished filming my video on how to heat emboss and I already edited it so it's currently exporting on my laptop. But this is what I was showing um, on camera. I showed how to do it with a pen, how to do it with clear stamps, and then two different tools with clear stamps and then I thought I would do three different embossing powders so that people could see like what it looks like. Um, the colors when they're embossed. Obviously, I just have like the basic ones. I don't have like pinks and turquoises and things like that, but that will be something I can always get later on. But I'm happy that I already edited it as well. Like that's three videos edited and filmed within two days, guys. So that's amazing. I now have like three videos to post on my main YouTube channel. So that's amazing. Eight minutes until eight o'clock, guys. But I want to show you guys a couple of packages. So I got one from Target. I only ordered one thing from Target. I think it was uh, scotch tape. But it might have been something else. I don't remember. And then I also got a package from Michael's. One of my packages. So I'm hoping this is the rose gold um, cardstock that I ordered. But I don't know. Let's see. Oh, yeah. So from Target, I just ordered a whole bunch of tape. It was cheaper on Target than it was on Amazon. And I had 5% off. Plus, I had cash back from eBay. So the cheapest on Target. I just needed some more tape. And then from Michael's, let me show you guys. I have two orders from Michael's that are supposed to be coming in. Oh, okay. So we got like this white kind of glitter card stock. We got this turquoise one. They sold out of the pink. I ordered pink also and then they canceled that. And then I got black glitter card stock. So I just have 15 sheets of each of these um, because, you know, I just want more glitter everywhere because every time we cut the glitter card stock, it gets legit everywhere. But that was a joke that I don't want glitter everywhere. But I thought I would try to make oh, different kinds of cake toppers with different colors. Okay, guys, one minute until I possibly might get an email. I mean, I highly doubt they're going to send me an email exactly at five o'clock on the dot. But I'm waiting for it anyway. I am so ready to get this email. And I'm so scared at the same time. You guys have no idea. This like is the determining factor of my future. It's crazy to think that I submitted this test, right? But there is a whole bunch of different graders and some people might grade, you know, more leniently than others. Some people more, might be more strict graders, like who knows? So it like depends on whoever graded my thing. Like my future is in that person's hands right now. Like, isn't that crazy to think that? Okay guys, well, it's five o'clock on the dot and uh, let's refresh my, yeah, I still got nothing. <laughs> I'm like gonna sit here refreshing my email. This is so stressful. Oh my gosh, guys, I just got the email. I don't know, I didn't click on it yet, mom. Don't, don't, don't hug me yet. What if I failed? No, I need your pregnant as you are. He's okay, she's I, I am sure about it.
a lot, but I passed. And it doesn't matter what score you got when you go apply for jobs because they don't ask you. All that matters is that you passed. So what I needed was a 41 to pass for special education and I got a 45, but I don't care. I freaking passed, guys. I passed. Now I have to apply for my licenses, which is more money to pay, and I have to apply for two licenses, general ed and special ed, and um, yeah, once I have that, then I can go apply for teaching jobs! Oh my god! My future! My future is that I'm meant to be a teacher. That is my future, I'm so excited that I passed, guys. You guys have no idea how happy I am that I passed. I freaking passed, guys. I freaking passed. The waiting time is over. I, I, I passed, Kuba. I passed. Yes. Where's my passing kisses? I passed. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Going to Ralph's Town Nices to celebrate. I just had some kielbasa because I got hungry. And then my mom was like, oh, I was going to take a Panera bread to celebrate. And I'm like, oh, well, I just ate. So then Andre came up with the idea of Italian Nices. So we're gonna go have some Italian ices. All right guys, so I got a strawberry margarita on top, Malibu Bay Breeze in the middle, and Java chip on okay. the bottom. Okay guys, I think we're about to get into some crafty mo. And I, I told you guys I wanna make some cards today, so I still plan on doing that. I wanna make some cards. Um, there is a couple more things I wanted to do. I made these cards the other day and they're just like cute little coffee ones. But I thought, I don't know if I should sell these in like a coffee set of four or if I should just sell them all individually. I don't know, what do you think, I, what do you guys think I should do? Cause I want to make two more different kinds, but let me know if I should sell them just as one or if I should sell them at like four in a set. I really don't know what to do with that. But let me know what you guys think. end up making a lot of cards I made two more of those coffee ones and then I made like a Thanksgiving one I was trying to make another one and it's the die is just just doesn't work um so I ordered like a whole bunch of dies from AliExpress um I think I told you guys or I might have not told you where from but I ordered it from AliExpress and I've been finding that the dies, well, first of all, you have to be really, be really careful with measurements because a lot of the time they're a lot smaller than what you're probably expecting. And some of the dies don't actually work very well. Um, so I will show you guys. This is what I was trying to do um, as soon as it focuses. So it's supposed to be like an open thing, but the whole inside of the die it just does not cut through at all. So... I'm going to leave a review on that die that it just doesn't really work. But here is the card that I did finish making. It's like a Thanksgiving thankful card. I think it turned out so cute. Um, and that's the only one that I made aside from the coffee cups. Um, I also applied for my license, for my teaching license. I had to apply for two licenses, uh, special education and general education, because when I went to school, I did like a long program for both of those certifications. So... I applied for that. I'm so happy I passed Ed Tipa. So my next journey of my life is starting to begin. Like, it's crazy. I'm going to be a teacher. I'm mean, like, you know, this was like the last step that I needed to be a teacher. And it's just exciting. It's going to be like a whole new journey. Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Please click that red subscribe button down below if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, and I'll see you guys tomorrow on tomorrow's next daily vlog. Bye!